evening viewers. Erha, what a lovely place. Let's go and check out what half past the alley is like about half past ten in the evening. Let's see if it's busy or not. Look at the views here, fantastic. Oh, the dear wee boy just fell there, injury, injury. A lot of families here, mostly couples, but a lot of families as well. It's a nice chilled out place there, huh? If you're not really into live music and busy nightclubs and stuff like that, this is a place to come. There is a wee bit where I met the guys just recently from South Shields, um, down at Tutti Frutti Square, where the bars don't open to really, don't get lively till midnight. That's the only wee bit that's kind of quite lively here. There's church bells coming. How you say? Look at this guy's clever look. Caricatures. Dustin Hoffman. But he's got dogs as well. So if you're here with your pet or you're a local, he's capturing all markets. Pretty nice here. Just came from up there. You head up there, two minutes up the road, Tutti Frutti Square, for all the kind of late night bars, you've got Busker's Irish Bar, I was in a few other bars earlier on, is it El Bosque, lovely wee bar, Maxwell's across from it as well, a few other bars, that's the church straight ahead obviously. Very, very nice here. Plenty of restaurants around the corner, I've done another video showing you some of the restaurants, it's all Italian restaurants really around that corner, I'll call it Italian co corner, that's what I call it. Italian square maybe even lots of Italian restaurants basically around there check out the queue for the ice cream I've done a video just recently and the queue is pretty big and it's still pretty big must be amazing ice cream here because every time I go by the queue is massive still lots of people in the queue let's even sneak by ok now they're all in the queue for the ice cream there but look this one here how they queue what's the difference let me know you yours MD, MD been in Portofino, he's got one of the best views. I'll try and see if I can show you if I go around this side. So, right out the back there, overlooking the sea, brilliant. Fancy wee apartment there. Could be quite noisy, I don't know what time these bars shut tonight. We'll find out tonight. My apartment's five minute walk down the road and it's a, it's a brilliant location, no complaints about the location whatsoever. Shops are open late here. No idea what time they're open till. I have a few old time. Uh, shops are open till one in the morning a lot of time. I don't, these ones will be open probably at least midnight I'd imagine. Okay, let's head up this way. I've not been down this side street, but maybe another time. Head up this way just now. Your tobacco shop there if you need any tobacco. Might be cheaper at the airport, mind you. Not sure. Most people tell me it's actually cheaper at the airport now. If you need a hat, like I normally do, you won't struggle here. There's lots of hat shops. <laughs> Right, I went by this place earlier on, it was busy and it's still pretty busy. Constant the whole day. Looks nice. Designer bags. Supermarket really should get some water for the room in there. That would be sensible. I've not done it. <laughs> What t shirts here? Yeah, 
Indians. Not too busy, the Indians. Tapas place is probably more busy. I said hello. <laughs> the shop's amazing. They make stuff in front of you. I don't know, they make, they, they're making it earlier on. It was, it smelled fantastic. Properly dressed for the occasion as well. Okay, so starting to come up to the tapas restaurants. You can see they're pretty busy at this time. Start to remind me a wee bit of Malaga city centre, run right about here. Lovely. I was in this tapas bar earlier on. Two tapas and a wee beer, four euros ten. It was unbelievable. I actually thought it was under charge me. I actually checked. And he's like, no, nope, that's the deal. You get the wee beer with the tapas, the first one anyway. Guy in the accordion. This is where I was earlier on. Don't even know him to be in it. It's quite nice. I'm just staying up there, around the corner to the right. Let's head up here, but see what it's like during the night. I've done a video during the day here. Let's see the difference at night. That's it, it's pretty busy. That place is busy during the day and it's just continued to be busy. This place is open earlier on and it's shut, shut for a wee siesta. So you basically you get a beer there and you get a tapas with it. How good's that? Brilliant. Free tapa with your drink, you see advertised there. Lovely here. Got a restaurant in there of yours. Nice, eh? Definitely going to stop and get a tapas. Oh, music alert of yours. Music alert. Okay, so this brings us out to the street that I started the video earlier on today. You've got a lot of nice wee shops down here. I don't even know if I've been in, down this way fully. I'll do a video tomorrow if I'm not. Just to show you everything really in Nerha. What a lovely place. Really, really glad that I came here and seen it. And I can understand I've got so many viewers on the channel that have said, Kevin, head up to Nerha. Lovely place. Really nice. Thanks so much for watching. I really appreciate it. I'm just going into a tapas and the beer. And don't forget, hit the wee red button, subscribe, it doesn't cost a penny if you're new to the channel. Regular viewers, give it a wee thumbs up, thanks for all your support, I really, really appreciate it. Nerha, one of the nicest places I've been to, without a doubt. I'll see you in the next one. Thank you viewers, bye bye.